Um, I guess the actual way to go is to get launched into the water. Mm, noted. Which is basically what we did earlier. But I just need to actually stand on the second one. Because I figured this cube is bigger. It won't go up as high. Or maybe they're the same size. I messed up. Come on, Drekki. Wow, I am I am messing this up. Sail. Oh, they've got things growing on them. Is this the future of VR? They're alive. We see them twitching. They seem to be... I don't know if it's the angle, but they seem kind of less human looking. They seem to be changing. Like, look, that thing has little wiggling things on it. Kind of like how that pig had that parasite. I wonder if these people are infected with something. I wonder what that parasite does. Because it seemed to make that, um... It seemed to make the pig aggressive. And then as soon as we removed it, the pig was pretty docile and just kind of chilled. Um, it seems like we removed a power cell of some kind. Another one over here. Let's see what this does. wonder if this is going to make all the water drop down. Oh. No, it opened this up. Is this like a containment vessel? Are we unsealing some cosmic horror they tried to keep? away from us? Hmm. We got our usual government little tape record machines. Where are we now? Ooh. People again. We can't hear the sound. So interesting. All right, if the water gets too low, the door closes. Hmm. We need to open. We also need to be able to get into the water, though. Is there anything we can bring from this other room? We have another another little launchy thing. Come on, guys. What you got in the basement? There we go. We got ourselves a little flotation cube. Perfect. So now I think what we need to do, we need to bring the water all the way down to pick up the cube. Um, did it bring your child to work day? What are they doing? 
I just... Oh, shit! Oh, what are you doing? Oh, he just fucking chokes me out. All right, noted. I had to give it a try just to see what would happen. Damn, he just... He just choked out a child in front of his child. That's... That's pretty brutal. Is that guy forklift certified? I don't know. It's kind of a small forklift for a giant cage containing like 15 humans. Feel like you need a bigger forklift for that. I don't know. So eerie that this area has no sound. Alright, we bring this down. Grab this cube. We need to go over here and push the cube to the side. Alright. I need to bring the water all the way up so it drops the cube. Then we need to bring the water down just enough. The door is opened, but we can reach the water from the cube. Good stuff. So if they were, if this is like an observation room, I wonder if they are testing this like reverse gravity water. But well, what would they need to use it for? What does this thing do? Just uh just an orb? Alright. You do you orb, I guess. Ooh. More people. Doing like maintenance on it. Ah! No! I wanted to push the button! I was trying to push the button. I obviously don't want people in their science laboratory. No! All right. Fine, I'll wait for them to go away! Fucking do your maintenance. See what I care. Actually, if that's the way I need to go, there was... Wasn't there something else? Oh, that's the only way I can go. I thought I could climb out of the water, but I guess I can't. Alright, guys. It's just you, me, and swimming around once again. It's like these people are computers. Oh, they're all just going flop. Oh. Interesting. Um. Alright, now we can definitely confirm they're not exactly human-ish. I don't know if it's because maybe they're injured? No, because... Hmm. is very interesting. Do they... Alright, we can do things. Now, I don't know if us being able to control them without the helmet is because of them being different. Like, they, they're just naturally being controlled by the nearest person. Or if that thing from... Uh, 
if that thing that gave us underwater breathing did something to like give us innately the ability to mind control. Is this what happens when a human is infected by that parasite thing though? Like, hmm, I'm so confused. Hip hip, hooray! Hip hip, hooray! Why, are you kidding me? Do I need to... Is there like a button I need to push to make it closer? Like, what's going on here? Alright, let's try this again. Uh, what am I missing? Like a box I need everyone to climb on to? Like, what the hell? It's kind of weird. Some of these people are just like arms and legs. Do I need to bring the water back down maybe? So creepy. I see. And then they throw me up into the water. And then I can just swim over and then drop down and hit the button. I got it. You know, this anti-grab water would be really cool in just general areas. Like, just aesthetically. Considering how weird all of this has been, I feel like it is for some kind of nefarious purpose. No, those are normal people. Yeah, I think it's something the, um, that little girl, me getting injected. We haven't seen anyone else with the helmets. <laughs> we all go plop. I wonder if all of the normal people down there are able to just passively mind control because of that plug thing. And so now we have the same abilities as they do. All right. They save me, then we get into the vents. Good stuff, good stuff. Uh, is that a bit of blood? Come on guys, I need you all to fall back down here please. Good job, minions. Now come with me. We have travels. Thankfully, we have our OSHA supervisor minions again. Uh, I think it's very important considering a lot of our other minions are um, currently suffering from workplace injuries. Uh, we really need to minimize any further workplace injuries. Alright, we got the boomy music. Fuck it. The sound of them all just falling down. Just... Plum, 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 plum. What are all 
all those people running to? No, I'm leaving my minions behind. All right, maybe we'll get some fresh ones. All right, we're getting to much more. Oh, that's a fresh cigar. That's lit. What are these like computer terminals? The phone is off? Did something happen? I'm wondering if we've broken something because of us running around. Oh, there's a... Camera on one of the people. Oh, shit! Oh, I thought he was coming to kill me. Uh... Oh, I guess everyone's distracted. I guess something did happen. Whose child is this? Alright, what am I supposed to do with this? Aha! Ladder. Ignore the child! We must peer inside this dome! We must see what all of our work has come to! We have built... the ultimate fish! This leviathan will control the world! It is the next stage in evolution. We were so quick wondering if we could. We never thought about whether we should have. It certainly seems like whatever this is, is momentous because everyone is clamoring over to it. Be like, man, look at that thing in the pipe. Isn't that thing amazing? Uh, ignore everything else, guys. We just gotta all make sure we stare at this thing that we have made. Meanwhile, a small child in the background. <laughs> Time to infiltrate while they're distracted. Oh, there's a yellow wire. A yellow wire. Hello, yellow wire. What do you have for me? Oh, plants again. One, two, three. We got 1, 4, 13, 12, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69, 70, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100, 101, 102, 103, 104, 105, 106, 107, 108, 109, 110, 111, 112, one wire at a time, but there's a whole, all, all of them are over there. Where's... I guess that's, uh, no place to check. All of it's connecting into that big orb. I'm not sure what that's for. Ah! Well, we broke our ankles. Let's try this again. Alright, I need to not be standing on it when we try to open it. Come on, Drecky. Uh
Oh. Not supposed to go up, so I guess we go down. No? We go backwards, maybe? There it is. Place is huge. Oh, we got some normal water. What is going on here? If I turn this off. I'm sure nobody noticed that. Oh, there's a thing down here to grab. Ah, we need to release this. Now we can open this iris. Hmm. All right, maybe we need to turn it back on. And maybe now it will... Oh, I bet if we didn't release the th those things, it would have pulled us, like, against a grate and killed us. But I think this way... We'll go through safely. Ooh, we're in the tank that everyone's looking at. Oh no, our clothes! Oh, oh, this is fucked up. Oh, uh, what the fuck is that? Let me just, uh... Let's just... Unplug this. Are they, like, trying to get my attention or something? Ah! I can grab the plug, but why doesn't it let me take it off? All right, dude. Um, that is, uh, did they Cronenberg a bunch of people? You see, like, multiple mind control devices. They basically make a giant synthetic brain. It seems like maybe this is controlling a large chunk. So if we remove these, maybe we'll free all the people? I don't like how that was grabbing me. That was kind of creepy. Nope, no, 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 fuck. Wait, what? Did that not game over? Oh. Oh, I'm... I'm the thing now. I'm gonna goop you! The game now becomes Katamari Damacy. Alright, well, I guess now I have the ability to, uh... pull the plug on this whole project. Fear me! Fear the blob! Ooh, I'm coming for you, Jim. Ow. 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 Ooh, I'm gonna get ya. Ooh, I'm gonna get ya. You can't stop me, Jim. I'm too powerful. I have the strength of many people. It's become one with the blob, Jim. Join us. Join us. We 
Are your future? No, no. I want uppies. Uppies. Yes. Help me up. Help me up. Good job, minions. Ah, fuck. Ooh. Hey guys, what's going on here? All right, since we're running rampant. Fuck your computer systems. Well, I guess we might need this cube, actually. Come on. There we go. I have the cube! Alright, and then we just kind of climb up this, and then we just climb up here. It's like everyone's just like staring at awe. To be fair, if a giant fleshy amalgamation ran through the office, I too would be confused. Hold on, did we? Aw, uh, we're not slurping them up, they just die. Dang it. I thought we could like Katamari ball these people. Oh, there's the executive. You know what you did. Oh, haha. <laughs> Revenge. Revenge for what you have done. Boy, he sure did go splort. Um, we have a stick. Hmm. What can we do with this stick? Man, that's some attention to detail. Like, the fact that we drug this through, uh, blood. And now it's, like, there's that, that string of blood that came out. Very nice. Come on. Look, in my defense, it's hard to control and, you know, have precision as a giant flesh blob, all right? I've got like 23 arms and 17 legs. It's just hard to know where I'm moving. Yeah, what are you gonna do to me now, dog? What are you gonna do to me now, dog? Huh? I'm the big meatball around these pots. Alright. We get up here. I wanna hold on. I wanna get the stick. Get the stick in a way where it's about to fall over. Let me get up, up, up. There we go. The meatball conquers the elevator. All right. With some trains. Um. Oh. Ah. Uh, ooh. All right, so we need to move away. And then he's going to escape. We're going to come after him. That's right. Open the door. Open the door. Wait, he's opened the door for me? Get back here! I guess I have to go down. All right, now I'm confused as to what they're doing. Are they like corralling me? Did they actually want to make this meatball? It's 
see numbers. Five, six. Hmm. Maybe we're supposed to go to the right. Um. Seems like fire up there. Ah! Oh. Alright, hold on. Let me move this back a bit. Drop it. Let me stand on top of it. And go up. Up. No, we cannot go up. Alright, so let's grab this cube and look around. Ah, uh, we can throw it up into this. Yes! The water, my natural habitat. And we even have a companion cube. Get on my way, cube! Need to drop it. What is with this incinerator? Oh, don't tell me we gotta go through the fire. I bet we just have to burn the cube, maybe? Ah, I see. So, we need to throw the cube over the sprinklers. We need to take it to that flammable area. Ah, oh, come on! Kind of weird that they funneled me down here. All right. All right, dude. Okay. Careful. Careful. Maybe gentle arcs. is a toasty fucking cube. Everyone seems to be following the meatball. They're like, what is it? What's it gonna do next? This is what I'm gonna do, baby. Burn, baby, burn! I don't think that's supposed to burn. We made this giant meatball just so we could ignite this. Hmm. Now what? I have like some kind of hook? What are they doing? Certainly a giant lever you got. Hmm. I need to pick something up to throw. Or maybe I just grab this. And I needed to grab this. Ooh, I'm coming for ya. Ooh, I'm coming for ya. Ah! 
Can we lift this up? Kind of. No, I don't think that's it. Like, maybe I need to go here and climb up. The meatball discovers swinging. I. What the fuck was that supposed to accomplish? Ooh, I'm coming for you guys as soon as I figure out how to walk again. Wonder if they're trying to just recapture their meatball. Because if it was controlling a whole bunch of stuff, it was probably difficult and hard to make. Pull the lever for me! But they're also helping me, so it's like. What is going on here? No! It's only temporarily open. Noted. Alright. Nice. Alright, we get through here. Oh, it's another cube. Give me the cube. Give me the cube. I want the cube. No! They baited and outsmarted me. No, not again. Those monsters. What have they done? You can't contain this meatball. I'll escape. I'll be free. As soon as I find a weakness in this room. There we go. You thought you could contain me. But you couldn't. That's just great. Good, great. Great. Mmm, fishies. Fishy, fishy, fishy. Oh, is that sunlight? It's been so long. I've been in the darkness. Horrible factories, father. Oh, the, uh, the light is not flattering to my visage. Now that's for sure. weird because like the scientists on one hand seem to sort of be helping me but I think it's more just to be trying to capture me again ah! took a bit of a spill there that's no problem hey we're outside baby we're free! Wow. Either we got bigger or those trees got really tiny. Uh, is this it? Did we make it to the other, other side? Hmm. The game looks like it's panning outward. I can't control my character. I think this is the end. Hmm.
Uh, gotta say, I'm a little more confused here. Yep, there's the credits. Interesting. Yeah. A couple hours shorter than Little Nightmares. Not too bad. I would say it definitely, definitely had me hooked through most of the game, but the meatball section... I'm confused. Uh, I feel like I saw this scene in the background somewhere. The scene with the mountain, with the with the trees, and then it comes out to down a mountain to a coast. I feel like I saw like a picture in a background that had this. Like, was this their actual end goal? Danish Film Institute, Danish Arts. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. As far as I know, this company has only made one other game, and that one's a bit more like black and white, but still a very like side scroller re situation kind of thing. Uh, well, we got free, but at what cost? We lost our... Like, if I think about it, you know, we had our clothes through all of that, and then as soon as we get into the meatball area, we lose them, becoming a lot like the other naked, sort of, like, mindless people. So we, like, lost the... We lost our individuality. And we were subsumed by... The masses, the the group think, perhaps one might one could say. Hmm. Not sure. Like what what is what was what is the difference between the mind control people and the people who were mind controlled? Ah. Uh. And it just starts again in media res. Right there. At least now we can load at any stage of the game. Okay. Well, thank y'all for sticking around for another week of Spooky Friday. I keep wanting to say Freaky Friday, but then I start thinking to the movie Freaky Friday. And it's like, I don't, I don't know, man. It's gotta be another alliterative way for a regular spooky, scary, regular Friday thing. Um, let me take these off. I'm done playing a little bit of dress up. You know, sometimes, sometimes you just want to look a little bit different. You want to wear a t-shirt from a silly, silly little checkbox game. Ah! Hey, Mint! I certainly did a hell of a lot of spinning as a giant meatball. But, uh, let's see who is still awake to raid into. I think that was a nice, that was a nice, concise little, little game. Ran about, didn't really overstay its welcome. Physics puzzles were very varied and interesting. I feel like it's... There is some good thought provoking it's trying to do, but I'm I'm not really picking up what it's putting down by the end there. Uh, I don't know if maybe the the secret from finding all the orbs will change my mind. I'll probably go find a YouTube video to see what that looks like. Uh, but it certainly seems like a game that might be I might see if anyone's done like any deep dives. I, I'm not one. I'm not super familiar with the Dutch company or persons who made the game. 
Um, there could be some other things that I don't understand. Like, you know, it could be like a cultural thing or something that uh, I'm not just cognizant of that would make things make a lot more sense. And it seems like a game, there's probably been someone who's done a video essay on it. Like, game, games like this and like Little Nightmares, the games with very good environmental storytelling tend to, tend to scratch the brain in a way to get people to do like, think very deeply about it, which is always a lot of fun. Hello, this is Drecky of The Post Production. Thank you for watching or listening to this series. Whether it was background noise while you worked, experiencing a game vicariously, or you just like my thoughts and reactions. Feel free to leave a question, comment, or suggestion of a similar game if I haven't played it. I stream on Twitch as Drecky Ormer if you wish to see things live and unedited. Regardless, have a great rest of your time zone, and I appreciate the time we shared. Bye!